Hey guys, hello fake account here. Um, I thought I'd just randomly make a quick video for you guys. So yeah, today I'm going to be talking about feather hair extensions, like so. I'm not sure if you can see mine, but yeah. So they're about. 15 to $30, depending on quality. Uh, mine was like 20 so yeah. So the tools you need, if you get the toolkit, um, it's about like 50 or $40. If you get it on eBay, it's obviously cheaper. So these are the tools you need. A looping tool, the pliers, whatever you call them, and the bike micro beads. And obviously, you need a feather. And I'll be right back. I'm sorry. So, if you want to get the tool, go for it, but if you're just going to get individually, um, you don't need the looping tool, it's a waste of money. I apologize for the camera. Alright. Hold it. Okay. So, you need this, of course, and you need have to have the micro beats, the feather, but besides not the looping tool. So, you don't need the looping tool, you just need a couple of rubber bands, like so. These, doesn't matter, any size, so you just put it through your hair, and I'll teach you, I'll guide, I'll tell you the tutorial in a bit, um, so yeah. If you buy the feathers, they come in various, um, in various types of, they're very, ty they're various types of feathers. So here are the basic ones. Many colors, they're really pretty. So, yeah, they're really pretty, honestly. So, yeah. And um, so the processing doesn't take that long. If you guys want to know where I got mine, um, I live in California, so um, in Los Angeles, California, so there many types of places like hair shops that they have. Me, I got mine at the hair shop. Yeah. So the hair shop's actually called the hair shop. Yeah, so let's get started with the tutorial. I'm actually out of micro beads right now, so I'm just gonna show you guys the basic. So you get your little rubber band, you slip it through on the area of where you want it, left or right. If you want it in the inside, you like so. You get it from the inside, like that. So if you just if you're like that, you just get some of the hair on the inside and slip it through. And if you want it here, you just slip the rubber band through. 
and yeah, I don't have any beads right now, so I'm just going to use some crafting tools, so I'll be right back. So you use a rubber band, you slip it through, all the way, like, you don't have to make it go through all the way, but if you start from the top, it just goes through. You just put it in, that, you get your little bead, slip it through the rubber band, so and so if the bead's on, you just keep pulling and pulling and like the bead just somehow slips on. You can just take your rubber band off. And then here, if you have, if you got like tipped feather hair extensions, they're really easy to apply. So you just put it through the feather, you put the feather through, and then you get your clear bar and you put tension on the bead. You put pressure on it, you just put it together and it just sticks on. And then it should turn out beautifully like this. So yeah, they're really cool. I suggest you get them. And sorry, I took too much time explaining what I do. So yeah, so if you guys have any requests, comment below. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.